Centuries ago it tended herds and flocks where Scotland and England meet, hence its name. The noble border collies, one true calling is working livestock. It relies on instinct, training, the gentle coaxing of a lone herdsman. Two good dogs can do the work of six men on horseback. That's why border collies have found a home in our region among cattlemen. At least that's what Stan Moore will tell you. He trains border collies at his home in Knox County. There are many dog handlers. Stan Moore calls himself a dog man. To me, a dog man is a person that understands the nature of a dog, can understand uh, personalities of dogs, and has some knack in communicating with a, with a dog. Border collies are born with a keen instinct to circle livestock. It comes from centuries of good breeding. But where breeding ends, training begins. And training begins with caressing, absorbing the touch of humans. It is the beginning of trust between man and animal. Fuzzy has been with Stan for just three weeks. She brings to the training ring only her raw instinct. The eye is like uh, the eye of uh, and foxes and wild animals when they're stalking their prey. This is the hardest part of the training, getting her to going. There, we, we. The main thing is to get her to try to circle those sheep. As I say, come by, she really doesn't know what I mean. I'm just using this stick to send her a certain way or keep her to go that way. There, there. Come by. I put it with her as she moves, see? I put the commands there. Come by. Come by. The commands come by and way to me, trace back to the Scots herdsmen. They must become second nature to her or the partnership will fail. Do those sheep know what you're doing? Not really, but they know to stay away from that dog. Genetics and training can only do so much. The rest must come from deep inside the animal. Not every dog has it. Meg does. She stands favorite. This will keep you from walking all the way down there and just use the dog, huh? Yeah, we'll let Meg take care of him. Meg, look at the sheep. We Meg doesn't need much coaxing. She was born in Scotland eight years ago, so working is in her blood, and she still has the eagerness of a pup. See the sheep uh, are coming in and she'll be able to pick them all up and see the ones over here on the side, they're beginning to come in too. Can you get her to bring them to the left of that tree if you want to? I can bring them either side of the pine tree. What's that mean? That means for her to move to her left. That just stopped her. Now I'm gonna walk her up. Slow her down a little bit. Move her to the left a little bit. I know Meg will work. Anything I put her to work, She'll work it, and, she, and she'll give 100%. She's a show champion, and she's a, a first-class farm dog, a ranch dog, and that makes the difference. She's the best I've ever had. That'll do. That'll do, Meg. Good girl. That's a good girl. Working sheep's her game. That's what she is. She lead us for. It is an ageless partnership, a bond best understood in a simple phrase. That'll do, that'll do. <laughs>